Hello, and welcome to another guide for scam. So in this guide today, I'm going to show you an easy and beginner friendly way to enter the bunker without stress of max shooting or seeing you. If you follow what I do in this video, looting bunkers will be easy as shooting fish in a barrel. Also, in this video, you will see the map layout of the bunker, a bird perspective of the whole whole bunker so you can see where max patrolling and what areas are actually safe. It will also show you what areas you need to avoid so you don't trigger the max or get shot. Let's start. I would rate this bunker as a very beginner friendly and easy to enter bunker. Both entrance and headshot have a jog way of entering. You can see on the bird perspective of the map where the entrance and hatchet are. Entrance is marked with the orange color and the hatchet is marked with the red one. Yellow lines, lines are the patrol routes of the max and the green ones are the easiest way for me to enter the bunker. As you can see on the map layout, there is only one level for this bunker, but it's easy to get lost inside. So keep this map open on the second monitor as you go through the bunker. It will help you while you loot, so you don't go behind yourself, you don't get lost, or you can even go and loot the specific rooms, like armory or the new medical cabinets. Everything is marked on the map. So let's go with the entering of the bunkers. I will show you the easiest way for me to enter the bunker. So I always go from the south side of this bunker. I go behind, behind this chest. I look for the mechs to keep patrolling to get away from me. So as you can see in the video, I'm just standing behind the crate. I wait for him to go in a different direction and then, then I can easily jog myself inside of the bunker. You don't even have to run for this entrance, so that's why I call it so beginner friendly and so easy to loot. You can do it with your gear on or without it. If you spawn close to it, you can easily go inside with only a stone knife. I'm gonna show you the entrance of the hatchet as well. For the hatchet, we go from the west side. Behind, we go, we hide behind this barracks, behind this little stone house. So, if there is puppets around, you can just bait them and get them on site. If it's the heavy one, the military, that is pretty slow, you can just run outside and make him follow you. After you get him away from the bunker for like 200 meters or even less, he will stop following you and you can easily get inside the bunker again. If it's an explosive puppet, you, you should bring a rock or something to throw at him, so don't come close. So when you throw the rock at him, he will see you and start running towards you. You do the same for him as well, because once you trigger him, it will take some time, but he will explode at the end. So that's the easy way to get rid of the puppets that are around the hatchet. So, this hatchet is also very easy to get inside. You just have to be behind the wall or in a bush. The max is pretty far away, so he will not see you. If he sees you, there is so much stuff that you can hide behind and you will not have problem of entering or exiting this hatchet as well. We will use the trick of opening the hatchet and then running to the, to the ladders keep spamming F on it, so it's just animation cancel, so you don't have to wait for your character to go in an animation of going down the ladders. It will fasten up your going down, and it will help you in a difficult situation if the puppet is running towards you or if you're running away from an enemy or a mech. So, this is all there is for the Z3 bunker. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. In the future, I will make new layouts and guides for all the bunkers on the map. 
If you want to see a specific one, leave it in a comment below. And if you want to see more content like this and support me, subscribe to my channel. Thank you and see you in the next one.